the left hand side in a beautiful view of the Hoda Zoo and the Beast and the So, how come Lufthansa is organizing this flight with the uh, 747? So, Lufthansa is doing this every year. It's the beginning of the Easter holidays in Germany. So, we want to offer something very special to our passengers, as many, many people want to fly to Mallorca, especially Palma. So, this is uh, really nice, I think, to fly into your holiday on a 747. Uh, what's the kind of population you have on the flight? Is it holiday makers or is it mostly aviation enthusiasts? Because I know I've seen a lot of people with cameras and everything. You're right, it's both. It's holiday and also it's a lot of uh, customers who love planes and who love to fly with it, who are really interested in all the technique here. So um, it's interesting, we have both. How do you like the experience as a crew member on this flight? It's great, of course, it's a great spirit. We are all from the public relation department and we love we love to do these special flights for the customers and to make it also a special event for them. Uh, so I suppose this is a much shorter flight than what you're used to in the 747. What kind of routes do you usually do in it? Oh, it depends, um, but of course we do South Africa, America, Asia as well. It's a really short flight on the 747, but it's interesting. Uh -huh. And how do you like the 747? It's my favorite plane. I, I, yeah, I, I'm flying on the 747 since over 20 years, so it's the queen of the sky. It is the queen of the sky. Uh, are there any differences for you as a crew member between the 400 and the Dash 8? Um, yes, it's a, of course the Dash 8 is a bit more modern, you can see, and the crew rest is a little bit more comfortable. But um, we have a first class on the Dash 8, we don't have a first class anymore on the 747. 400. I would say this is the main, main difference. Thank you so much. Any final comments about this day? Yeah, it's a great day. It's, we have wonderful customers as we usually have and um, we love the experience and we hope many of, of you will fly with Lufthansa soon again. Do me a favor and be really careful because it's steep, okay? okay. And you can close the door maybe. The crew rest. Yeah. So we have 10 beds here, as you can see, and it's, you should not be claustrophobic when you want to have a nice rest here, because as you can see, you can barely stand. <laughs> um, we have bed clothing here, and then we just, everyone has a number, a special number for the bed, and then we sleep <laughs> and we close the curtain. Is it comfortable? It's super comfortable. Really? Yeah, it's comfortable. It's a real mattress and sometimes we have uh, breaks up to three hours, depends where we fly to. So you can stretch and you can really lay flat. It's really important because of all this ups and downs. So eight, yeah, the ten. <laughs> so you squeeze in ten people here if you want to. Basic question, how many cabin crew on a Boeing 747? So, the minimum crew today for this long range flight as a short range operation is 10. So we need to have 10 flight members, we do. And when you fly long haul? And when we fly long haul, it's most of the time 15. Mm -hmm. It 
also depends if the plane is fully booked or not. Exactly, because it's one per 50 passengers, right? Yeah, right, yeah. It has to be one per 50 passengers when it's uh, like uh, as a minimum crew at least. Uh -huh. Yeah. Excellent, thanks. Yeah, you're welcome. Let's go down. Yeah.